Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you how to make apple jam. In Russia we also call it pavidla. The name might not be Russian, I'm not sure. Anyway, this is a very thick jam and it only has two ingredients, apples and sugar. There is no thickening agent or no pectin and it goes inside very famous piroshkis or as a simple spread on your toast in the morning. So let's get started. I went to the market this morning and picked up these beautiful honey crisp apples. I have five of them. But you can use any type of apples you like. But first we have to core and peel our apples using this uncomplicated device. But instructions on it were rather complicated. So I thought I will show you how to use it. First, you need to crank this arm up and down and secure your device to the table. Then remove protective cover from the corer. Push down on the guard that's holding the corer mechanism and pull it all the way out. And there's another guard that's holding your slicing mechanism and peeling mechanism. This needs to free float so it can adjust to the size of the apple. Then as simple as that, you just put your apple on that corn mechanism and you start turning. And by turning the handle, your apple is going to go all the way up and it's going to be completely coreless and it's going to be skinless. And the skin you can use on your Christmas tree. Yeah, as a Christmas decoration, why not? Then you remove the core and keep going, slicing and coring and peeling your apples. As simple as that. I really love this tool. And you have to inspect your apples, each apple. Make sure if there is any core left on the apple, you have to remove it. Or if there is any, any peel left on the apple, just remove it. After I'm done playing with my fancy tool, we need to weight our apples because there's a certain rule you have to follow in making jams. And I will tell you the perfect ratio for making this jam absolutely perfect. You need to get 100% of apples to 70 to 75% of sugar. So for example, you have, if I have three pounds of apples, I will need two pounds and 10 ounces of sugar. Place your apples in the pot and put them on the stove. We need to steam them and to help them steam faster, we need to add about 50 milliliters of water and they're going to be steaming with a closed lid for about 45 minutes. After 20 minutes of cooking, check on your apples because all apples are different. So it, for some it might take longer, for some it might take less time. But for these apples that I had, it took me 45 minutes to get them to the perfect consistency when I can actually blend them. Then using the hand blender you need to blend them and now it's up to you. You can either keep the little pieces of apples or just blend it to a perfectly smooth consistency. Just like that. Now we're going to add all our sugar, we're going to mix it together and we're going to leave it on the stove at medium heat and we're going to start cooking our jam and the cooking time would be one hour and you have to stir your jam constantly. I didn't tell you it was a two day process, didn't I? Well, it is. Well, after one hour of cooking, we're going to turn up the heat, we're going to leave it overnight and we're going to finish cooking it tomorrow. Next day, cook your jam for additional 30 minutes, constantly stirring it on the medium heat. And we're going to do a little test to see if our jam is ready. We're going to put a little bit of a jam on the plate, we're going to let it cool completely. And if this uh, jam doesn't move, it's completely set, then our jam is ready. Now there is a fun part of packaging your products. So you're going to need a clean jar. You're going to transfer your jam in the jar. You're going to close it and put it in the fridge. And don't tr try to give it away yet because this jam has to stand in the fridge for a couple days until it's completely set. And I have a little bit of leftover that I can simply spread on my toast in the morning. This beautiful apple jam can be stored in the fridge for up to three months, so you can enjoy this liquid gold 
every single day. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked my video. Please like and subscribe and I will see you soon. Bye!